recording. All right, so we have a Baron Postmas with us in the gallery today, and we have a beautiful painting here that he did in the 1990s of uh, Mammoth Lakes. And Baron, tell me what was going through your mind when you uh, painted this. Well, I've always loved this area. Uh, there's a whole string of lakes in this area from the ski area, which is up in this direction. And uh, I came across this lake, and I'm not sure which one it was. It's one of the smaller lakes, uh, not like Lake Mary or the Twin Lakes, which are, would be down here. And it had this tree in it, and it was uh, an early storm, and it was getting cold, and I was just drawn to it. I, I, just, I just wanted to express how much that I loved that area and how much it's meant to my wife and I, who actually we got married up there. Uh, That's pretty interesting. Yeah. I, I love the way you, you've got the sun catching this peak over here. I mean, that, that really draws your eye into the center of the picture. Now, did you use a trained eagle there, or was that, that a later addition? Oh, that's, that's Harold, our pet eagle. <laughs> no, that's, actually, that's an offspring. Uh, they have them up there, I guess, fishing. Uh, the reason for the broken light was the broken sky, and the clouds were coming over very fast. And uh, part of it's in light, part of it's in the shadows from the clouds, and I, that's yeah. A, As that's it does over in the Mammoth area, yeah, it does. When I've skied over there, and those, it, the light changes very rapidly, and it does. You know, th this is a fantastically detailed painting, especially for the size. You've got any. I know, I know, it's a long time ago that you painted this, but how long did you work on this? Oh, quite a while. Uh, I mean, I. I did every tree, <laughs> and that took forever with a little tiny brush, and I quickly wore that out and had to buy some more. Uh, yeah, I was really into the detail because that's that's really what catches you in that area. I mean, it's a big here's this big basin with the lakes in it, and there's so much going on, and that's what I was trying to capture. Yeah, and and I photographed in that area, and and also you 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 know get caught up in the detail that's there in the light. It's oh yeah, fantastic. And uh, you're, you're famous for your clouds, of course. And even though this is over 20 years ago, thank your you. clouds are great. So you were you were doing great clouds way back then. So yeah. huh. this painting is for sale in Seaside Gallery, and uh, you know come in and look at it. And I think that you'll probably take it home. <laughs>